concerned about the rising rate of poverty and socio-economic inequality in Nigeria, the Social Economic Rights and Accountability Project, Sarep, has organized a media briefing titled Failed Promises, Corruption in the Water, Health and Education Sectors in Nigeria. Speaking on the theme of the event, Sarep's Deputy Director, Kolawale Uluwadare, said the event which was put together in the interest of citizens is to ensure responsible and accountable government governance at all levels of government in the country. Our transparency and accountability initiatives cut across all sectors and in the fight against corruption. But we chose these three for the objective of, uh, I'll call it the low-hanging fruits, because they are very important to any kind of human and social development, and because so are to simplify the issues for people. Again, we are in election year. If we understand the issues in these three key sectors, we can use it to interrogate the, the political issues around us as we go towards elections. So that means we need to move away from the rather pedestrian politics of tribe religion and political affiliations to asking those who want to be in public office before the elections, what is their take? on these three sectors, which really unites everyone in Nigeria, whether you're poor, rich, from whatever ethnic stock you're from, you're from whatever religion you are, these three sectors unite all Nigerians. And that will mean that we can commit these individuals to the promises they've made. And it is not a, an issue whether they will fulfill those promises ultimately, but to ensure that even when we want to engage them post-elections, because governance will continue after the elections, we can hold them to say, you said this on this, now you need to deliver on those promises.